uh, marketing, you know? But anyway. A little on the weather, but mostly sick. Fully sick? Yeah, bro, you are pretty fully sick, dude. So that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense that you're fully sick. Um, but yeah, sorry to hear that, you, that you're sick, man. But it's also good that you're fully sick. Because that's better than not being sick at all, in my eyes. Because fully sick is a good good title to have. But yeah, what do you mean? What do you mean playing like? And you? then there's Chunky. Josh Jones, thank you so much for following as well. Welcome on in. Welcome Chunky's in to the Lego dead. Star Wars book. I'm just currently sorting out pieces because I don't actually have a uh, a sort of sorting uh, container of my own. So I, uh, you know, just pretty much only. only do this so yeah um yeah well, welcome on in though just jones uh, hopefully you're a big fan of Star Wars. also i should ask what is everyone's favorite star wars what is everyone's favorite star wars super auto pets unite and smash the classics fair enough fair enough fair enough yeah i, I think i've given up on unite dude it's just i'm just kind of like uh as much as i like the game i just got too many other games i want to play you know, and I, I, I like, I, I don't want to constantly be tied down to it because I found that a lot of people would only come in for that game. And I was like, oh, not all of you guys. You, all of you guys here right now are fucking awesome. You're, you're always constantly here and I very much appreciate that. Um, but there were some people that only came for Unite and I was like, oh, I don't really want that turning into the channel. So I, I just kind of stopped doing that. I just want to play what I wanted to play because sometimes... I didn't actually want to play that, but I said I would, like a night prior, so I wanted to make up to that to you guys. Yes, 4 to 6 best. 4 to 6, you're an OG Trilogy fan. Nice job, dude. I love the OG Trilogy, man. Speaking of which, we're actually building the OG Trilogy set. We're building the diorama of the Death Star trash compactor scene. Nice, so call this one. I just logged on to lego.com and they have the Inquisition from Kenobi. I've got to get that one. I was looking at that. Um, I don't know how I feel about it, personally. I mean, granted, look, look, it is a sick set, don't get me wrong. It is very, very sick, but I don't think it's a set for me. Um, but, and I only say that I would, if I had space for it, I would genuinely buy it, but the space. I don't have enough space for it, man, unfortunately, because I've still got the tall neck to put up, and I still want the UCS Razor Crest, if that rumor is to be believed. So, yeah. But four to six. I also like three. Three's really good. I genuinely think two is the worst out of all the original six, though. Um, because nothing happens until right at the end of that film. At least in episode one, you got, like, a little bit of action here and there. Most of those we've been... I have! It's fucking sick. Especially episode three, dude. Very much so. The Unite is very dark. Yep. Yeah, very... Which is awesome. But but to, to in order to grow and actually have a consistent viewers, you got to really only pretty much play Unite. And I'm like, well, I don't want to only play you know you know i don't want to be tied down to to only ah. one game so i was like yeah you know i'm just gonna i want to be able to do it there's a little r2 uh, i just want to be able to, to play what i want man but yeah i appreciate the unite community so much because they are they, they're they're not toxic at all like in any way shape or form at all they're super super chill they're super super awesome community um but yeah they're just pretty much only there for you know and i was like uh, Kind of, it kind of made me feel a bit odd sometimes. I'm also OG Star Wars fan. Honestly, it's not the ship. I want the minifigs, so I might just keep, wait and get the minis off Bricklink. That's... You're amazing. Says you. A little too diehard. They are very sweaty. I just picked Unite back up, played it at launch, and got a bit bored. It's okay. There's just so much buy this, buy this, buy this, that it's 50% that it's notification management. Yeah, actually, I agree. I agree. The notification... They really shoved the notifications in your face, though, dude. I guess that's a... That's the, uh, the marketing ploy. And not ploy, but... Of a, of a free to play game, isn't it really nowadays? Isn't it? It's just shove fucking microtransactions in your face. But Gally says you, you're fucking amazing, dude. Mike, yeah, the, the, the minifigs I really liked. I like the Grand Inquisitor. Uh, I actually don't mind Reaver as a character. I understand why people uh, don't like her, but personally, I don't mind. Like, I mean, Starkiller was like pretty much the exact same as her, like, super aggressive, which is fine. She's, she's a Sith user. Like, she's a Sith, Sith user. She's a dark side user, dude. Like, she's meant to be aggressive. And, and it, it, you know, everyone's different. Like, the the fifth brother, they made him out to be a bit of a dickhead. <laughs> in my opinion. Compared to Rebels. 
But he's still kind of cool. But um, I, I do not condone the racism that, that Ingram... Mo, uh, Moses Ingram is her name. Sorry, I was about to call it Ingram Moses. That she's been receiving, because that is, in my opinion... And Ewan said it the other, da the other day. If you're racist at all, you're not a Star Wars fan. So, I, I just don't condone at all anyone getting like sending you death threats or racist comments because it's just so such a fucking waste of not only her time but like you know it just proves to me that you're just a racist piece of shit so um i do not condone that at all i actually find her she i actually think she's a very attractive person um and you know i i don't sort of no, no, don't sort of. I don't condone it. Because the, 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 the amount of hate that she's been receiving lately is just disgusting. People say she's not written well. I personally didn't have a problem with her. Um, I think, as I said before, the actress is... Or the actor, sorry. Sorry, I shouldn't be saying actress. They're all actors. Is very attractive. Um, and yeah, I, I, I genuinely think she did a good job with what she was given. Maybe a few things could have been written a bit better, but you know... It's not her show, it's an Obi-Wan show. So, Obi-Wan's writing's pretty spot on. Reminds me of non-toxic League community, know what I mean? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! No, I do. I actually, I found, because I do play League of Legends, that's no secret. Um, I found lately that actually, my League games that I play, I don't play League all that often anymore. I used to play it way more back in the day before I started streaming, and then I found a far better usage of my time uh, with streaming, um, was that the games have actually been a pretty positive experience for me. Um, which is pretty cool. But yeah, man, that's so deep. Loved Reaver. Yes, I love to hear that, dude. That's awesome, man. Uh, yeah, that's... Uh, I genuinely really liked her as a character. I think, you know, it's only episode three that we're in now. Like, it's... it's. I'm interested to see 